IBM recently announced the addition of containers to Bluemix. So what are containers on Bluemix? Bluemix is IBM's cloud platform and is committed to open standards and governance models, Cloud Foundry, OpenStack, and the Open Container Initiative. We understand that no one size fits all for your needs, and there are three runtime styles. And virtual machines, platform as a service with Cloud Foundry, and now the addition of containers. Bluemix supports public, dedicated, and local deployment scenarios, and hybrid cloud with their secure gateway providing secure connectivity from your applications running in the cloud back to your applications or data within your data center on-premise. We believe you need a rich set of services and a consistent way to bind those services to your applications. The services in the catalog come from both IBM and business partners and include things such as security scans for your application, both static and dynamic, machine translation, globalization delivery services, Watson services such as Watson Insights and text-to-speech and trade-off analytics, powerful sets of APIs right at your application's fingertips. For the recent container support, you can start a container using your private registry. Each organization gets a registry for their images. You can manage the deployment across your spaces. Using Bluemix Spaces, you can have isolated environments for your development, test, staging and production needs. When deploying a container, you can choose to bind the public I- a public IP address to your container. And you can also bind services to your container, leveraging those APIs from the catalog. You can mount a volume to the container for your persistent or shared data. In addition to single containers, there's also support for scalable auto recovery groups. With auto recovery groups, multiple containers are deployed in behind a router. And you can bind a route to the auto recovery group, providing a host name and domain. There's integrated monitoring with Grafana and also log collection and aggregation built right into the platform. There's also DevOps services. In DevOps services, You can edit your code locally as you normally would, or directly in the browser. Using the tracking plan capabilities, you can manage work items and sprints. The user interface supports mobile devices. And best of all, there's a continuous delivery pipeline. Using the continuous delivery pipeline, you can consistently build, test, and deploy your application's changes to Bluemix. There's support for machine translation and the global globalization. We have support for consistent static security scans so that as you're making changes to your application, you're aware of any vulnerabilities that may be introduced. Support for the deployment both of containers and container groups using red-black deployment and zero downtime strategies. You get notifications for all jobs and stages or just failed jobs directly to your Slack or HipChat channels. Together, Bluemix and DevOps services makes continuous delivery to the cloud repeatable and fun. To get started, simply sign up for Bluemix using your IBM ID. You'll need to create a namespace for containers. This namespace will be the name used for your uh, image repositories. And then try one of our samples. Using the Deploy to Bluemix button, Simply clicking the button will clone a project, create a delivery pipeline for that project, and begin a deployment out to Bluemix. The free capacity that comes with your trial Bluemix account is really impressive. It includes two gigabytes of memory for your containers, up to 25 private images in your registry, two public IP address, and the ability to use routes with your container groups. Give it a try.